Hi, today we're at Bedford Golf and Tennis, located in Bucolic, Bedford, New York. And we're speaking with Bob Nielsen, Certified Golf Course Superintendent. Bob, how long have you been here? I've been here 38 years now, Ken. Congratulations, <laughs> I, I think. <laughs> so, uh, Bob, you're a, uh, consider yourself an environmentalist? I, I've been pretty involved with the BMPs, and so yes, we, uh, we monitor our, our water quality here at Bedford. Uh, by requiring them in the wetlands. So yes, we do try and do as much favorably for the environment that we can. You know, Bob, I like this BMP we're gonna talk about today. I think it's a uh, simple uh, BMP to implement. It's a pretty cost effective uh, and very effective uh, environmentally. Uh, tell us about this BMP, Bob. I agree, Ken, I think this is very effective. What we've done is we've taken um, the regular um, cleanup sheets that you use if you have a spill. These are just spill pads, uh, pretty inexpensive. And then we take pieces of plywood that we cut to the exact size of the drain, whether it be a square one or a round one. And then we cut the pads so that they're exactly one inch wider so that when we put them over the drain, they can absorb even more. So you can see here we have a round drain we just send the guys out that are cutting fairways first thing in the morning when we're going to spray and they cover the drains like uh, such. So your guys who are spraying don't have to, to, to put these in place, they just spray? They spray but they do have to pick them up. Okay. okay. Uh, especially if we have a product that we're going to water in because these will be, they, it shortens the lives pretty by quite a bit if you don't. Um, if you let them get super wet, right. you know, water, watering product right, in. Right, right, right. And so now but you've got really a, is a simple thing, and you can see that there's no way that the pesticide will be able to get in there. And even if it does get watered in, it's, it's yeah. not going to be a problem. Yeah, and you use these when you fertilize too. Correct. Yeah, yeah. So you're you're preventing any chemical from uh, uh, being a, a direct point source uh, pollution into your water system. We like to think so. The one yeah. thing you do have to realize when you're using fertilizer, you have to real when you pick them up, you kind of have to toss it. You have to toss because the fertilizer will land on top, so you want to toss it away like that. Gotcha. When it's pesticides, you can just pick them right up and throw them. Gotcha. The gotcha. Well, I, like I said, I love this BMP. Uh, how much money do you think you've got invested in uh, in this BMP? Less than a hundred dollars. Less I mean, between the plywood, the. The, the, the spill pads last for about a year. At the end of the year, we just rip them off, throw them in the trash, and then staple new ones on. And how much time would you say that adds to a fairway mower's job in the morning? It's I, less than 10 minutes. Right, less than 10 minutes total, and, and probably uh, to pick them all up uh, as they're going around, the sprayers are probably adding, what, maybe 15, 15 to- 20 minutes. Yeah. To their tire to their to, yeah yeah right okay well i think this is a great bmp that uh, everybody should consider implementing uh thanks a lot for your time bob thanks ken